Alright, so this is Mike and Mike from JT Fit Human Performance. Today we're going to go over the CFC 2015 hit element for the Delta Division. Um, it's going to be 30 inches for the guys, 24 inches for the ladies. We have a step up or a box jump. Um, we're going to give you our two different alternatives for those and why. Um, so first we're going to show uh, Mr. Jack Rabbit here, Mike Barbeau is going to show you how uh, you want to do a box jump correctly without hurting yourself as well as being the most energy efficient. So Mike, let's see what you got. So you can see he's landing softly, he's not collapsing on the land, he's stepping down. I really recommend not jumping down, it's a lot of joint pressure. It's a long 90 seconds and remember this is the first leg of the pit. You don't want to get in trouble when you hit the deadlifts, you don't want to hit in trouble when you hit the thrusters. Um, so there's that. You can really do bounding if you wanted a couple back to back. So Mike, let's show them that. I really only recommend this for guys that and females that really are very familiar with this. This is a large jump to do this with, uh, but I personally will not be doing that. What I personally will do, and uh, take it for what it's worth, we've done extremely well in the pit. We've won a couple of them in the uh, what, Mid Atlantic or teams have placed first. I'm going to have our athletes really stride, uh, going to do the step ups. Uh, so you want to make sure you're hugging a corner. This is going to allow you to really uh, open up the hips and not get a lot in the way here. So stepping up, it's just the same. Good. The biggest thing here, it looks like it's slower, but you're going to be much quicker later on in the pit, I believe. Um, and I'll see you in the pit because I'll be doing these. But you'll be able to conserve energy without taxing yourself, and then you'll be able to go ham on the. Uh, deadlifts and thrusters. That's your uh, CNC pit element box jump slash step up. Get it.